Welcome to myprojectbazaar.com Our project title is Dynamic Cluster Members Scheduling for Target Tracking in Sensor Networks Now we discuss about the abstract of our project Our project abstract is In order to collect information more efficiently Wireless sensor networks are partitioned into your clusters The cluster provide, provides an effective way to prolonging the lifetime of wireless sensor networks in this project a position based clustering and the energy based cluster edge selection approaches with an extension to the energy prediction has been proposed to prolonging the lifetime of wireless sensor networks by evenly distributing the workload the proposed clustering method following the basic principle of EOERP protocol the proposed EOERP is reducing or eliminating a such individual node formation and improving the overall network lifetime when comparing with an existing protocol. The PSO based energy efficient routing protocol called the Enhanced Optimized Energy Efficient Routing Protocol that is EOERP is proposed. The cluster in the existing optimized energy efficient routing protocol result in individual node formation for eliminating such a individual nodes the concept of EOERP are, are used to used for the cluster formation the NS2 simulation results shows the proposed approaches is more efficient than other distribution algorithm now we discuss about flow diagram of our project first one is an network formation the network formation are formed with a given range of the sensor the nodes are grouped automatically depends upon their radio waves agents are formed for a group registration the simulation work has been done within the network simulator ns2 version in the simulation nodes are randomly distributed within the network field of the size given region. The TCP is used to establishing the connection between the source node and the destination node. FTP that is the file transfer protocol and the randomly choosing the different source destination connection. Next one is on a protocol implementation. Here we we here we implemented in enhanced optimized energy efficient routing protocol. The protocol containing uh, uh, each node position velocity speed is updated here. Using this protocol, the cluster formation is done. The cluster formation takes place using the determinants of eligible nodes of clusters. Here, the position based clustering on is done then the energy of the node the cluster head is used to monitoring the member of the cluster nodes each clusters heads containing the every node position speed velocity and the energy list it is very used to identifying the member of the cluster node the cluster head is based on the energy of a node uh, in one cluster which node have a high energy means that node ha that node is indicated a cluster head then the cluster communication it is as it is assumed that the sensors node sends the data after detecting an interesting event the cluster head collects the data aggregates into a sense to the base station to save some energy we may think of one relay among the cluster heads can send the data to the base station to utilizing the bandwidth efficiency in treat of a multiple cluster heads one relay can deliver the messages to the base station can reducing the energy consumption and the enhancing the energy efficiency next one is on a performance versus a different network parameter analysis is being done for on a proposed protocol the parameters like a total energy consumption throughput backhead deliberation and delay are calculated here now we are going to discuss about output of our project first to open the terminal window now change the directory so type cd space our directory name our directory name is pso then directory changing coding, coding is cd so type cd space pso now change the directory root into pso 
then now I run the main.tcl file so type ns space main.tcl now run the process here the each and every second position velocity speed of the node is calculated here this is EOARP protocol work then this is a NAM console and it is out.nam window file the out.nam window file display our output this is zoom in button and this is zoom out button play back button that is rewind button play forward button stop button play forward button and forced forward button this is time simulation and time setup now i play the project the 31th node that is a base station and the dynamic node deployment is here the network creation is done next one is cluster uh, cluster formation is done here the position based clustering is done now the energy based cluster head is selected here now the member of the node is moved to form one, one cluster group now cluster formation takes place now the cluster communication is start first first the member of the node sends a communication to the cluster head uh, this fourth node is wants communication to the 20th node so it sends a communication to the cluster head then the cluster head sends a communication to the base station and the base station uh, routing the then the base stations then the base station sends a communication to the uh, uh, next cluster head uh, which uh, which node containing the destination is find so the neighbor is find here the root optimal routing path is directed here now zero the node sends a communication to the base station the cluster head does not communication sends to the another cluster head it only sends the base station communication then the base station sends communication to the cluster head the base station sends uh, every cluster other every cluster head and check the destination node if only 22 nodes sends the reply messages so only 31th that is the base node sends the communication to the 22 cluster head here the inter cluster communication is done here the intra cluster communication is done N then the 22 node sends the destination to the location now reach the communication thank you for listening now i run the graph file x graph space pdr pdr.xg comment is you should display the packet delivery ratio of our graph here the existing system is lower when comparing with an a proposed system next one is an x graph space throughput dot throughput dot xg this is an a throughput graph thank you for listening our demo is completed